Hey, everybody. Jeff here from Outseta. Outseta can be used to build all different types of recurring revenue businesses, but most of our customers are either building SaaS products or membership sites. If you need a charge for access to your software or your content, chances are Outseta is going to be a good fit for you. In this video, I'm going to give you an overview of all of Outseta's key features so you can understand how Outseta can help you get your product to market that much faster. Outseta's billing system gives you all the tools that you need to manage subscriptions, collect payments, and handle tax compliance too. We're a Stripe verified partner, so you're going to start by coming over to the Billing and Settings tab and connecting to your Stripe account. Once you've connected to Stripe, you can come over to Billing and Plans and set up your first pricing plan. Outseta allows you to set up individual or team-based subscriptions and supports pricing models from subscriptions to one-time payments to per-user pricing models as well. You can easily set up free trials, charge setup fees, or sell add-on products too. All aspects of Outseta's billing system are designed to make it easy for you to collect payments, change your prices, or change your pricing model anytime without involving developers. Now that you've set up your pricing plans, we're going to move on to setting up Outseta sign up and login features. That starts here on the auth sign up and login page. If you have any site that users need to log into, you want to leave this send sign up confirmation email toggle checked. What that does is after someone signs up, it sends them an email that validates their email address and prompts them to set a password. Once they log in, they'll be redirected to whatever you set as the post login URL. Moving down to the signup settings, this is where you can specify what information you want to collect from users on your signup form. Once somebody signs up successfully, they then get redirected to the post signup URL. That's typically a thank you page of some sort. And in addition to allowing users to sign up with an email address and password, you can also allow them to sign up and log in with their Google account. With these settings in place, you're ready to move into the actual implementation of Outseta on your website and within your product. That starts over here on the Auth and Embeds page. Outset it actually integrates with your product through three embeds that we call the Sign Up Embed, the Login Embed, and the Profile Embed. The implementation is dead simple. There's a single script that you see here on the page that you can copy that goes into the header of your site. From there, we provide Sign Up, Login, and Profile links that trigger each of our embeds. Let's show you what that actually looks like on our website. Here we are on outsetter.com. And if I come over here to pricing, for example, you can see a pricing table on our website. Let's say I want to pay monthly and I want to purchase the startup plan. I click this get started button and this is outside a sign up embed. This is how somebody comes to our site, inputs their information and actually creates a subscription or membership. After receiving that confirmation email to set a password, a user can come back to our site and click on this login link. This is how somebody would actually log into our product. Once they log in, so here I am with an Outseta, they can come up here and click on a link that says my account. And this is Outseta's profile embed. It serves as a user profile, but also allows the user to do things like invite team members if they're using team-based memberships, upgrade, downgrade, or cancel their subscription, as well as maintain their billing information and download their invoices. So it's really a self-service customer portal. Those are the three integration points between Outseta and your site or product. But the final thing I wanna show you is protected content. If you come over to Auth and protected content, you can easily protect any content on your site. In this example, I'm gonna create some members only content that lives in a folder on your website called members only. And I want to only grant people that have particular subscription, let's say the growth plan, access to that content. Once you've done that, your content's protected and only somebody with the appropriate subscription level would be able to access that content. Now that we've got all of this configured, we'll move on to the tools that you can use to manage your business on a day-to-day -day basis. What's most unique about Outseta CRM is it's purpose-built for SaaS or membership businesses. Here I am on an account record. 
You can see for this particular customer what subscription plan they're on, how much they're paying, when that subscription started, and when it renews. And most importantly, you can easily make changes to their subscription or membership directly from their CRM record. You can come here to change their renewal date, you could change their subscription altogether, or you could cancel their subscription too. No need to log into other tools. Beyond that, I can scroll down the page and I can see in the history section how their subscription has changed over time. Let's say I had a customer that needed a refund. I could easily pull up their previous transactions, open their latest invoice, and issue a refund without logging into another tool. That's a central concept in Outsetta. We're trying to keep you in the product for everything that you need to do related to managing your business. Back on that account record, all the information you see over here in the account info section is completely customizable. You can also just quickly see the actual customer lifetime revenue associated with each customer. That's the actual amount of money that you've collected from them over the time that they've been a customer of your business. Scroll down further and you'll see an activity feed showing you everything that's happening with members related to this particular account. Next, I wanna show you deals. If we come up to CRM and deals, this is the tool that you'll use to manage your sales pipeline. These columns that say engaged, demo completed, and closed one are completely customizable. So if I have a demo with this company here and they end up signing up for Outsetta, I drag them over to the closed one column and that's how we track our sales pipeline. Last but not least, I wanna show you segments. Segments are groups of users with some sort of shared characteristic. And this is a really basic example. This is a segment that looks specifically for people that are on a free trial. We use this segment to trigger an onboarding sequence that teaches people how to use Outsetta during the course of their trial. That's a really simple example, but it can get much more sophisticated. If I come back here to segments, this segment, for example, specifically looks for people that haven't logged into our product in 14 days. As soon as that condition becomes true, people get added to the segment and we use it to trigger an automated email that goes out and helps us fight churn proactively. The email asks the user if they have feedback for us, if they need some help, and gives them the opportunity to book a call. So these sorts of sequences are super common in the context of SaaS or membership businesses, but very difficult to set up when you're using a separate authentication tool, a separate CRM, and a separate email marketing tool. Without Seta, you can set up these sequences in minutes. Outsetta's email tools are unique in that they allow you to send transactional product and marketing emails from within the same platform. Here I am within the email designer. I have a full drag and drop email designer that allows me to design any template that I see fit. Once I create a design that I like, I can come up here and save it as a template to reuse it for future sends. Let's take a look at some of the emails we've actually sent at Outsetta. If I come over here to email it, uh, email and broadcasts, I can click on any of the emails that we've actually sent. This was one of our company updates. Here I can see outside as email analytics. I can see the percentage of people who opened the email, the percentage of people that clicked on links, the performance of specific links, and I can even jump in and look at this on a recipient by recipient basis as well. Next, I want to show you the drip campaigns feature. If you come over here to drip campaigns, this is how you would set up email automations without setup. We use these for things like onboarding sequences when people sign up for a free trial. If I click into the sequence and click on content, you can see that I've got a series of emails that are time delayed one after the, the other and are triggered by somebody signing up for a free trial. So all the infrastructure to build out these sequences is right here in your Outset account. Finally, there's transactional emails. If I come down to settings and transactional emails and emails, you can find a list of the transactional emails that Outset sends on your behalf. These are used for things like lost password workflows or notifying a customer that one of their payments has failed. No more fumbling around with SendGrid or other transactional email tools. All these emails are already pre-configured in your account for you. Best of all, Outsetta's email features have industry best deliverability rates of about 99%. Outsetta's help desk gives you access to three tools to help you grow a happy member base. 
a support ticketing system, a knowledge base, and a live chat embed. Here we are within the support ticketing system. This is a shared inbox where all of your customer service requests will get routed. Here's a request, and you can then assign that request to anybody on your team, whoever the appropriate person to respond is. If you want to talk amongst your team, you can click on notes down here to have some discussion. Or if you're getting the same questions over and over, you can save templated replies to common questions down here. Whenever you're ready to reply to the question, you can jump in here and type up your response. Next, we have Outseta's knowledge base. If you come over to help desk and knowledge base, you can easily categorize your content into different categories that you configure here. Actual articles are written just by clicking add an article. You give your article a title, you can add screenshots and videos, all that kind of stuff. And whenever you're ready to publish your content, you just click published. All of the content gets published to a publicly accessible knowledge base that's gonna look something like this, but be skinned for your brand. Here on your knowledge base, users can easily submit a support ticket. They can search through your content or they can jump right into your articles. Here's a tutorial, for example, specific to Webflow. Finally, there's Outseta's live chat embed. Within your Outseta account, if you come up here, you can open up your chat inbox. You can add a live chat widget to the bottom right-hand corner of your website. And if somebody is talking to you who you've spoken with before, you'll see their name is automatically populated on their chat conversation. Your correspondence with them gets tied to their CRM record, but if it's someone you haven't talked to before, you'll see that they show up as unknown, like users down here, until you capture contact information for them. Our live chat is meant to be toggled online when you're actually available and able to chat with customers and offline when you're not. If you toggle your chat offline, customers are still given the option to submit a support ticket. With these tools in place, you can retain more customers and grow your SaaS or membership business that much faster. Outset as reporting features are broken into billing, engagement, and cancellation reports. Here we're looking at our billing reports. You'll see all of the common metrics that you see in SaaS or membership businesses. Things like number of subscribers, monthly recurring revenue, the actual amount of revenue that you've collected. And then you can also look at revenue by product line, churn, uh, trial conversion rates, and things like the amount of discounts that have been redeemed as well. You can look at these metrics for all of your products in aggregate, or you can easily slice and dice to look at these metrics specific to any of your products. Next, let's take a look at our engagement reports. Engagement reports track how users are interacting with your product or your website. In the context of our business, right now I'm looking at people on a free trial and I can see which features of our software they're actually using. I can see which accounts are using support tickets or lead capture forms or setting up pricing plans. So this is really good insight from a sales perspective. I can spend my time with the trialers that are most engaged with our product. If I flip this over to subscribing, I can now look at the behavior of our users that are on a paid subscription. So I could see that a customer might be using feature A and B, but not C and D, and I can reach out to them to get them to use product features that they haven't yet adopted. This feature is also very commonly used in the context of membership sites to see what sort of content is resonating with your audience. Last but not least, we have our cancellation reports. You can come over here and create your own cancellation survey with your own cancellation reasons, then serve it up to your customers when they cancel. You'll capture feedback on why they're canceling here, and you can also capture quantitative or qualitative feedback, excuse me, in the comments over here. But best of all, if you scroll down, you can see on an account by account basis, who is canceled, what product they were subscribed to, how much they'd spent with your business prior to their cancellation and why they canceled in the first place. These sorts of insights across these reports give you insight to build a healthier company. That's a wrap. Outset can help you get your product to market that much faster and scale your business much more efficiently with a lot less software. If you have any questions whatsoever, you can reach out to our team at support at outsetter.com, or if you're ready to go, you can sign up for a trial on our website. Thanks so much.